Good evening. How y'all doing? What's happening? I had to talk about this Veronica Wu. She was some apparel founder. And she said that uh, she stepped down. They should kick her butt out the country for real. For being racist and insensitive like a mo. She said black folks are the real racist. And she also had the nerve to part her lips to say they're lazy. Guess she don't know what black folks have done in this country. See, when you probably, she probably got a white zaddy who be spelling that. You know, let me tell you something. When people come to this country, they get told to stay away from black folks and act white. That's right. They get told that, hey, you want to make it here? Think white, act white, be white. Stay away from them black folks. You can wear them clothes. You can listen to that music. You can think it's cool, but don't you get too close. Or you ain't getting back in this house. See, because she's supposed to be enlightened and entrepreneur and a business person. And then she went off the rear, off the tracks. What makes them act like that? Because that's how they're taught. America's racist, systematic, institutionalized racism teaches that to cultures. Not all Asian folks think that way. However, a great number think that way. Great number think white is right and black is forbidden fruit. And when you part your lips to say something like that, you've been taught that systematic. Vanessa Wu didn't just wake up one day and just say, ha ha. I'm sure she saw George Floyd getting his neck stepped on and being lynched. And she's seen the last decade of black folks being lynched, but that's lazy. You shiftless, you're not accountable. That's what that's what she's saying. You know, when I hear white folks say that black folks are racist, I said, what do we own? To only be a racist person, you gotta have control over people play of everything. Last I checked, black folks don't own nothing in this country. They spend more money, but they don't own nothing. That's how you're racist. You can be ignorant, you can have your biases. But you can't be racist unless you control something. Black folks don't control nothing in America. It's still white America. Let's just keep it 100. No reparations, no respect, no loyalty. You know, but this this chick who don't obviously don't know nothing about American history, doesn't understand about the Civil War, doesn't understand about slavery, doesn't understand about that black folks built this country. That black folks have sacrificed for her to, to thrive in this country. Yeah, I said it because without black folks, you don't have other minorities that can thrive in this country. Who else has given over 400 plus years of freeness and not been compensated? Every other group has gotten reparations. Black folks ain't got nothing but a bunch of shuck and jive. A bunch of, we'll get you back. If you, just like, you do this, we got you. What they got? Hollywood's a plantation. America's still a plantation. We had the Black Wall Street. They got White Wall Street. Who? What does everybody go to? Wall Street. I'm telling you, that's what they've done. And when you get somebody that comes out and spew this ignorance, that has been taught and ingrained. Vanessa Wu has been through to know. She knows where her bread is buttered. Probably got a white zaddy too, pimping her. If you ain't with them, pimp that money, tell you where not to go. If you're out there in Silicon Valley, wherever you is, you know what's up. Anyway, that's my thoughts and takes about that old ignorant, racist, trash Vanessa Wu who stepped down from her apparel company because she made loaded remarks about black folks. She ain't the only one. She just balls enough to come out and say it because Donald Trump gave them permission to say it. That's right. Please hit the like, subscribe, and welcome thoughts and comments. And I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. And uh, you can see George Floyd's. You can see black folks being disrespected left and right. But somebody going to come out and still say black folks are lazy. Ain't going to still come out and say black folks are racist. And still going to come out and say black folks don't amount to nothing. That's what you get. This is what you see all the time. Because America, when they don't teach critical race theory in school, when they have these lying governors and people trying to take things away from black folks, there's no reparations, there's no compensation for the legalized genocide against black folks. 
this is what ensues. I'm out.